Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to my channel, Eat Healthy, Get Rich, Drink Good Beer. If you don't know me, my name is Taranjit Singh Rai, and I help college-going students, university-going students to get onto that property ladder, to save for their marriage, and if you're a young adult, maybe to pay off that mortgage. Today, I'm gonna teach you a technique that I have been recently using, not with huge amount of money, but with tiny, tiny amounts of money. The technique is basically getting early into the projects, trying to get whitelisted for good projects, trying to get invested into good projects very early on. One of the ways by which the rich maintain their status as rich other than tax avoidance is actually they get the chance to invest in early with DeFi space with crypto space you have an opportunity here to enter into projects early and today I'm going to talk about two good projects that I think can easily do 100x of course I'm not a financial advisor these videos are for entertainment purposes only if you're looking for financial advice you should see a licensed financial advisor a quick look at the markets it's still not out of the red Bitcoin is hovering around 59,000 with a really strong support at 50 55, 56,000. Uh, Ethereum is hovering around 4,300. But I think this is just a temporary accumulation phase. The mass adoption is going on. Only 300 people on the planet still use uh, crypto. That's a tiny, tiny, minuscule amount as compared to 8, 9 billion people on the planet. Imagine even if 30% uh, of the global population start using crypto. You guys are very, very early. My plan is, I can only talk about my own uh, opinion and plans. My plan is to hold through the next bear market and see where I am. Remember, I'm only investing $50, $60 into each project. This is the money I'm okay to lose if everything goes down to zero. Everyone has their own limit of how much they can afford to lose. Mine is very small. It's only 50, 60 quid. However, using these 50, 60 quid, I have been turning them easily into 1,000, 2,000 quid. And today, I'm going to introduce two projects which I think, if you do manage to get in early, can easily give you 10 to 100x. Of course, crypto is the most riskiest investment, so be very, very careful. The first project, which has not even launched yet is called Mintrest. I've been hanging on their Discord, been hanging on their Telegram, which is more than 20,000 people now. And all I have seen is, is a dedicated team and very, very responsive team. Now, DeFi or decentralized finance is basically the start and end of uh, the traditional banking sector. There is no people governing it. It's just a piece of code that governs it. There is no intermediary. You're not paying any bank. You're not paying for any space. There's no electricity. A piece of code dictates what you earn, what you lose, so on and so forth. Mintrest are doing things really, really differently. They're giving the community to get in early. So the way you get into early is just by an email sign up. I'm gonna leave a link for the email sign up bot in the description at the very top so that you get to the correct Telegram. Telegram is full of cancerous, scammy, scumbag, thieves and, and, and scammers. It's crazy the amount of people getting duped. So be very, very careful and I will leave a link in the description as I said that will take you straight to the sign up. All you need is an email ID and you will receive a guaranteed allocation. It's only two or three days left. So how does it work? It basically has its own AMM. So that is automated market maker. It automatically distributes the value it captures from the interest rate, flash loan and liquidation fees to the users. I've been making a lot of videos on AutoShark Finance, for example, squidstake.com, for example. The APYs are insane. On some of the cryptocurrencies, I'm earning 200 to 300% and even on some of the cryptocurrencies, about 1000%, which is is absolutely insane this protocol is launching on moonbeam so moonbeam is about to win the second slot on the dot parachain auctions the first slot has been won by akela mintrest is launching on moonbeam and moonbeam is almost guaranteed to win that second slot this is a once in a lifetime opportunity to make money guys if you are so scared of so many wallet seed phrases just do it on binance Binance has a polka dot slot options. The total value lock, so a color is 32.5 million. It's, it's just absolutely crazy. Moonbeam is almost on 35 million now. The third protocol which I have committed my dot is Aster. I do believe that uh, these protocols will win the slot options. Just look at Kusama. Kusama is way over 300 now. And that's exactly what I predict dot to be in two, three years time. At the same time, you will get a lot of free Ikala, a lot of free Moonbeam, and a lot of free Esther that you can actually then sell on the open market. Only condition here is that you have to lock DOT for two years. I'm absolutely comfortable with. Binance is also giving you B dot that you can use for anything you want in place of normal dot. Anyways, coming back to Mintrest, Mintrest is launching on Moonbeam. So it will be able to use all the scalability and also the security of the Moonbeam parachain on the Polkadot blockchain. The investors in Mintrest are like the who's who of the investing world. So if they are investing, I think it's okay for us to invest as well. Absolutely amazing team. They have all provided their Twitter. They have provided their LinkedIn. So Josh Rogers is the CEO. He's also very active on 
telegram you can go in and ask any questions and he will respond even in the lay terms and also sometimes in a very technical terms all of these guys they're all dogs yeah one thing that is missing is probably gender <laughs> equality here maybe some of the female coders will be uh, good to see here but anyways it's a good solid team okay so that's number one the number two project that i think has 100x potential is soul chicks just like mintrest i have given you early chicks also if you go onto their website you can whitelist and you can pre-register if you don't want to do that it's also launching on cx pad which is the coin x pad you need to hold 30 million tokens of cx pad to get guaranteed allocation soul chicks is a play to earn fantasy game which is launching on solana so Solana is really fast, amount of money needed for transactions is minuscule. The chick NFTs look absolutely amazing. They are absolutely gorgeous. The reason why I have picked this is, this is integrating NFTs into Metaverse. These guys, they have two sets of NFTs that were all sold out and using these NFTs, you can actually play in the video game. So you can participate in battles between players, so players to player, you can do raids, you can do bond, you can do training. There are 50 plus dedicated team working behind the scenes on this project. So again, looks like a very solid investment to me. One strategy I use to do research into these games is look at the people who are investing. It's who's who of the metaverse ecosystem that have invested in this uh, company. So if you look at the tokenomics, they have 10 billion tokens. Visors will get 12.3, seed investors will get 7.9. Uh, the biggest chunk is reserved for airdrops, P2E and staking reward. The team gets 20%, which is slightly higher, but maybe it's a big team. 10 billion tokens for this kind of game is absolutely normal. Guys, game development takes a very, very long time, but I think they, the, the roadmap look very, very reasonable. I think they should be able to release a good game by mid next year. But again, you guys will be very, very early. My strategy for these games is just, I will stake, keep earning uh, passive income, but that's my next Axie Infinity. The NFTs are listed on SoulC, which is your OpenSea equivalent on the Solana network. Again, if you have been using OpenSea on Ethereum network like me, you have been cursing the Ethereum blockchain. A few days ago, I minted one, actually minted two NFTs. The NFTs were only $200, but I paid $250 in mint fees. It's absolutely ridiculous. Anyways, those are my thoughts. What I'm now interested is to hear your thoughts. So please tell me in the comments below, what do you think about SoulChex and what do you think about Minterest? Of course, if you like the video, subscribe to the content, hit that bell notification button, and I'll see you in the next video.